friends from Schultz's Guest House in Denham are stopping by for this week's pet parade. Denny and Gary, thank you so much for being with us. And you have some very special pups to introduce us to this week. We do. This is Harmony right here. And Harmony came from a group of five pups. And they all pretty much look similar. Um, they were actually found down in Tennessee at three weeks of age. Their mother had been hit by a car and killed. Oh, so um, and sad. they were just left by themselves. Um, so they were all rescued and uh, together and they're nice, happy little pups. These two, um, Tango and Salsa here, um, Tango's the boy, Salsa is the girl. Um, they were actually found down by our rescues down in Tennessee as well. They were found at about three weeks of age, um, huddled under a gazebo um, in a small rural town. And we don't really know much more of their story either. So do you have any idea what kind of breeds they are or how big they will be? We have no idea. We're guessing... As far as breed goes, we're guessing maybe 50, 55 pounds is our guesstimate. Um, only thing we can really guarantee on these guys are their genders. <laughs> we have no, and how cute they are. They are so cute. There is no arguing with that. They are adorable. How old are they right now? They are three months old. Okay. And do you have any um, requirements for the homes that they're going to be adopted into? These guys, I don't think, are going to need anything super specific, but definitely families that are going to be able to spend enough time with these pups. They're going to need a lot of training. Um, they shouldn't be home for more than three or four hours at a time. Um, great training is a high recommendation. Um, they're young. They're puppies. They're going to get into anything. So um, just people who are willing to supervise them and really, you know, put them through the training that they need, um, training, socialization, so they can become really good dogs. Anything about their personalities that stands out? They're all, there's, I, you know, it sounds cliche, but they're just sweet, little, adorable, snuggly little puppies. This one's giving me kisses right now. They are so adorable. So for people who are at home watching and they're interested in adopting these cute puppies, how can they meet them? They can go onto our website, um, which I believe is going to be at the bottom of your screen, and... Um, submit an adoption application, and once we receive the adoption application, we will reach out um, to go further with that. We are on private property, so all of our visitations and adoption appointments are by appointment only. Okay, and then today actually marks the start of a very special week. It does. Today, um, through the 9th, is National Animal Shelter and Animal Rescue Appreciation Week. And actually, one of the things that we're doing, alongside of just appreciating what we do, uh, we want to invite other people to help and find a unique way to appreciate their own rescue dogs and all the dogs that we rescue. We have been fortunate enough to have been provided with a new transport vehicle. Um, I mean, if you look at our vehicle right now, it's pretty bare and white. Um, well, you can see on this one, we've actually superimposed some photos. What we're actually trying to do right now is give people an opportunity to support rescue and honor their own dogs by having their dogs' images, photos, um, even companies if they wanted to put their company logo. Um, just a great way to, to honor rescue and to honor rescue dogs, um, dogs they have at home. Our transport vehicle travels across the country twice a month, every two weeks, picking up rescue dogs. So it's just out there driving around, and it's just a beautiful thing to see just happy, rescued, smiley faces that have owned dogs that are going to be on there. And providing that same hope that these, mm -hmm. the puppies you're rescuing will have their forever homes. Absolutely. All right. Well, thank you so much for stopping in and you're joining welcome. us for this week's pet parade.